What is up guys, it's your average typical YouTube commentator here, bringing you another video. And today we're going to be what talking about- What the fuck are you about... doing right now? Oh. Get out of here. Oh, no, 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 Get the no, hell out of no, here. No. I'm gonna squeeze just, your nipples. I'm get kidding. Out of here. I'm kidding. No. Dude, no, I don't okay. care. I'll, I'll I don't go. care. No, dude, get out of here. Get out of here. No, get out of here. I'm gonna kick your ass right no, now. Okay. Get out of here. Okay. Sorry about that. That's what happens when you leave your door unlocked. But anyways, today, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for six subscribers. That's a huge, huge number. But today, we're going to be talking about something that happened to me the other night while I was practicing some surfing. I'm going to provide you guys with some behind-the-scenes surfing gameplay. Something that most people don't get to see, but now here, for a limited time, you guys will be able to see what I go through every single time I try to record for a video. So, I decided to go on CSGO to kind of practice my surfing, you know, because I have absolutely no clue and I want to start getting better at it so I can use it for gameplay in my videos. Because I don't really like to embarrass myself so much uh, to the point where I get really mean comments about how I suck at surfing. I haven't got one yet, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get one. But anyways, the story continues and pretty much what happens is so these two kids uh, by the names of A Shanky Danky and A Danky Shanky. Now, I could be wrong, but I think these guys knew each other before they actually came to the server. Like, I mean, I could be wrong. These guys could have been totally completely strangers to each other. They probably have never seen th themselves in like real life or they probably have never ever met somewhere but I'm just saying that their name is a complete coincidence I think there's a connection so these two gentlemen come into the server and they start talking to us and now at first they seem you know kinda cool I mean they they do sound a little bit of a you know of peasants they sound like they're just complete peasants and they start talking and all of a sudden the shit goes fucking, like, it goes 0 to 100 real quick, man. Like, these fucking kids started telling us shit about our moms that we didn't even know about them. Probably our moms didn't even know this about themselves. These kids were freaking savage. These kids turned into goddamn doctors in, like, a matter of seconds, telling us diseases that we had that I have never even heard of. They're probably not even curable right now. For, like, a whole solid two minutes, the whole voice chat turned into, like, a Yo Mama show. Like, it was so, it was so... So, what's the word I'm looking for, man? What's the word I'm looking for? Toxic as fuck. And so, for like a solid two minutes, I sit there and listen to him. Have to, have to cover my sweet, innocent ears from such toxicity that I, I start, I start having hallucinations at night. I see dead people. But no, for real, these kids went on for about like five minutes talking about how they were doing my mom last night pretty hard. Um, until the point where I just, I kind of just got annoyed and I, I thought it was pretty funny. So I just, I recorded some of it. So I'm going to, I'm kind of just kind of, I'm just going to show you guys some of the stuff that they said. Cause I feel like, uh, some of these, these, these kids, I, I think they're just, I, I don't know. I don't, I'm not really sure. These guys were obviously, uh, they, they, they got, they got, they didn't get enough attention when they were little kids. And, and also I think th their wieners are probably small too. That's, that's probably why they do this. Um, I think they're just self, like, th they don't have self-confidence. So to make up for it, they, uh, go on CSGO servers and just make fun of other people's moms. So I'm going to show you guys, uh, some of the stuff that they said. And hopefully you guys find this funny, um, because I did. I certainly found it pretty hilarious. So, uh, just, just, just roll the video. Just roll it. Yo, the kids that still argue back are the kids that are adopted. Damn. Wait, so you just said you're adopted, right? Because you just fucking responded to me. Do you have actual fucking autism? My fucking dad knows the guy who's adopted, so shut the fuck up, you're triggering me. Yo, yo, my fucking dad knows someone who would ass rape you for a dollar. What? What? What in the? What in the? What? His dad knows someone who would rape you, who would ass rape you for a fucking dollar. Who the hell? Where where do these kids come from? Like where what deaths the hell do these kids crawl out of, man? And that's not even it. These kids go they go there. They pull the fucking race card, man. These guys don't have the fucking dignity. These guys have to fucking crack a black joke. What hey. does how does a black girl tell if she's pregnant? And you know what? This is way too fucking sickening to put in my video. So I am not going to put this in my video. But I hope that most people know this joke. Because I, I knew this joke. I, I have black friends, guys. Mexican, you sound like you have a dick in your throat. Dude. Poor, poor little Mexican potato man. All, all he wanted was help on stage 7, guys. That's all he wanted. He never, he never wanted to get into this, but they brought him in. I need help on stage 7. Hey, Mexican potato. How about you fucking answer me, right, pussy? 
then and then these kids they pull the biggest fucking card that I know they tell us we're gonna fucking DDoS you you fucking fat hey uh, Mexican we're actually DDoSing get booted <laughs> fucker we're gonna boot hey. everyone all hey, through right, this fucking server that spectate this server's gonna try be to mine motherfucker and then and then they hit me with the biggest the biggest freaking insult that I have ever heard in my life like I am still I'm still trying to recover from such, such deep insult. Like, this made me cringe and cry. Like, I went into the corner and started crying. Like, I cried myself to sleep that night. How hurt I was from this, this horrific insult. Go fucking eat a bologna sandwich, you kid. Yeah, they told me to go eat a damn bologna sandwich. I, I don't like bologna. And then they proceeded to, to the ultimate, the ultimate insult, man. They insulted our wiener size. A little bit wider on the first one. Do a really wide. Yeah, dude, you gotta no, make your we'll dick a little bit wider because it's a bit do. short, fucker. No, exactly. Another, I bet your dick only stretches to two inches, you, you fucking small ass shirt. Yeah, but eventually they left, and uh, I guess we were just not cool enough to have them in our presence. Or they probably were busy because, you know, they're such pimps, and, you know, they don't have time for us. They're such, like, badasses. They, they probably didn't have time to, you know, hang out with us peasants. So they must have left, you know, to, to, to do important stuff, obviously, um, and, uh, you know, fuck our moms and shit like that. So, um, anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and uh, if you guys like more videos like this, please leave a like, and subscribe if you're new, because it always does help. But uh, if uh, Shanky and Danky are watching my video, then uh, there's only one thing i got to say to you guys. I hope you freaking burn.